Well, we, we sit here, or as we sit here, we're on 440 acres of land approximately, and um, we're, we're, we're hoping that there's development that, for the reasons I just stated, that there is development coming here. Um, as has occurred at Woodbine, we're hoping that, that the gaming will be a catalyst for the development. Uh, whether that manifests itself in, in terms of an entertainment center or a hotel, we're hoping that will do it. Uh, we have zoning along, along Guelph Line, so commercial zoning. Um, the good news is, is Milton continues to be the fastest, or one of the fastest, if not the fastest growing communities in the country. So we, we, I expect we will see demand for that commercial space. And any net income from property development here much like at Woodbine, will go into horse racing. And, and one thing that I've been asked many times, and it's important to see this crowd, we at Woodbine do not think of ourselves as Woodbine's a thoroughbred track and Mohawk's a standard bread track and, boy, what's going on over at Woodbine? How come you're not doing it at Mohawk? We don't think that way. We're one company, and any profits from development at Woodbine are going to support Mohawk also. So, I mean, that, that question gets asked every, you know, many times when I come over here, they say, how come you aren't doing the same here? Well, we will. We just need the market to catch up. And as far as the balance of the land, it's complicated. It's uh, the, with the lagoons and the conservation authority and the floodplain, it's, it's just not that easy. We, we have a plan for what I'll call some of the back 40 there in terms of development, uh, but I think the, the initial, uh, the initial uh, development here, Jason, will be around the casino and on Guelph Line, and, and we're, you know, we're working at it, but it, uh, we're waiting for that catalyst and trigger, so.